It's milking it time again and it has been a while. If you don't know what milking it is, it's a rant show where I take a comment rant, a topical rant, and my own little personal rant. So let's just have a little rant about it. We can start with the comment rant. I actually got a significant amount of comment rants this week and that was sick to see. Head over to the Instagram if you want to take part in it next time. I'll be doing it maybe once a month, something like that, but just keep an eye out for it. And I got what is possibly the most specific, most random, definitely the weirdest rant I've seen to date. And that was from Aaron. His rant is the missus in the maternity ward and not letting me take a shit in the toilet. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, no, no, that does sound very annoying, mate. I cannot stress how annoying that sounds. Also, big congratulations to you. Healthy baby. Bless up. Ellie definitely has to be the winner of this one. It's too relevant for me to ignore. Too many deadlines for Christmas cheer. Very true, accurate as hell. I stupidly struggled with deadlines this time around and it has put such a stress on Christmas. And I hated that because I've now finished it and I get to do this video, what was sick, but I just had so much stress building up to it. It feels like it was never ending. Big O stressos, not good for deadline season. Why put deadline season around Christmas? It's not fair. I don't like it, mum. We had a couple of others. Lee, I wish I could come to Grimsby for Christmas. I think it's really cute. I think you look really cute. Hugs and kisses. Love you. Bye. Slow fucking walkers. Love that one. Big cool. Although I have a little bit of a personal rant about that because slow walkers, I think a lot of people need to learn how to walk slow. Like, so if you're walking in London, there's an, a speed that everyone walks to and that's fine. I like that. However, I feel people get too caught up in that and they just storm around everywhere. Like if you're not in a rush, have you ever tried like sitting back in your heels and just like proper strolling? Like enjoying, taking the scenery in, taking it all in. I think people need to learn to walk slow again. Is that too much to ask? I remember talking to people that have like, think I'm a lunatic for want wanting to walk slow. I'm like, what's, what's your rush? Where are you going? What you gotta be there for? You gotta be there, yeah, walk fast. If you don't, like, enjoy. Just take it, take a chill, relax. People walk too much in a rush nowadays. Comment rants over, get involved next time. Link down below, or just leave me a comment. Sick, do you agree with my, these comment rants? Topical rant, topical rant, we're gonna summarize it very quickly because a lot of shit's been going on since I did this one. We'll hit the main three categories that I'm sure you all want me to talk about. Watford, bottom of the league. Political state of the system, having a prince that's been involved in sex trafficking. Now, I kind of feel for the royal family, you know, because we've all got a creepy uncle, but yet my creepy uncle isn't being prosecuted by the US authorities for sex trafficking. Yeah, that one's a hard one to keep down. The interview that he did is the most condemning thing of all his evidence. <laughs> like, he just is an idiot. He is just blatantly lying about things. Big up Woking, Pizza Express is fucking, he, they're loving life now. <laughs> Such a weird thing. For all those that don't know, I live in Surrey. I've been to that Pizza Express throughout my entire life. Never saw Prince Andrew in there, so big shame, but scumbag. Political system, we're fucked. That's all, that's all you get from me on that one. What for bottom of the league, we're fucked. That's all you get from me on that one. We're gonna finish with my own personal rant. My own personal rant is something I've been thinking about for a while. Uh, it's really been grinding my gears and that is the baby on board badges that pregnant ladies wear on the tube or anywhere that is a badge that is referring to them being pregnant. Now, those badges aren't for pregnant ladies. They are for fat people. Let me clarify. I don't believe the purpose of that badge is to indicate that that person is pregnant and you should give up their seat. The actual use of it, the actual use of the baby on board badge is to save the embarrassment of the person sitting down asking a fat person if they would like a seat. It's to save the embarrassment of those two people 
specifically the fat person because the person sitting down isn't going into the conversation looking to offend someone, they're going in trying to be sweet. If you were pregnant and you are going onto the train, someone would either ask if you'd want their seat or you would ask because you're pregnant. That, that just makes sense, that's fine, you can do that, that's the ultimate small win you get from the burden that is childbirth, is that you get seats on public transport. You should be proud of that. Walk in, be like, fuck you, get out. And everyone's like, yeah, sorry, no worries. However, that's not the case. Because when you're sitting down and someone who comes on the train who is large enough to possibly be pregnant, we do not ask now unless they have a baby on board sign simply for the embarrassment it may cause a fat person. I, it's almost ludicrous that in that essence. Like, it's not, it's being worn by pregnant ladies, but it's not being worn for their benefit. <laughs> it's being worn for someone that is overweight's benefit. No, I, I think that's nice of them to do that. <laughs> it's, it's sweet of them to do that, but it's definitely not for them. Because if you're pregnant, you just walk on and you'd accept the seat that's being given to you, or you just ask if I could sit down because I'm pregnant. You know? The baby on board badge is not for pregnant ladies, it is for fat people only. And that is my rant for this week. Baby on board badges, or is it increasingly harder to say, baby on board badge. Baby on board badges are for fat people. That's all right, you heard it here. Fat people only, get them out. If you've enjoyed them, leave it a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think. Obviously, I'd like to know these things. And had a lot of comments recently, so it'd be nice if you had done that. Let me know. Let me know if there's any ranch you want to hear. Apart from that, Christmas period is coming up. Look out for Christmas videos. It's always fun, festive, enjoyable. Bye. Bye.